Hi. Now for this part of the question, we're asked to find the equation of the normal to the curve C at the point where X is zero. Well, in other words, what we've got to do then for this is to find the equation of this line here going through the origin that's at right angles to the tangent. And to do this, in the previous part, we found out that the gradient at any point on this curve is given, as we know, by dy by dx. But we found that dy by dx, let's just write it in here, turned out to be equal to e to the power x root 3 multiplied by 3 cos 3x and then plus root 3 sine 3x. So if you're unsure about that part, just go back to part A of this question where we had to differentiate the equation of the curve C. Now, if we get the gradient of the tangent at this point uh, O, okay, at the origin, we just need to look at what dy by dx is when x equals 0. So when x equals 0, dy by dx is going to equal then e to the power 0, because 0 times root 3 is 0. Then we're going to have 3 cos 3 times 0, so 3 times the cosine of 0, 3 cos 0. And then we've got plus root 3 times sine of 3 times 0, well that's 0. So we've got plus root 3 times the sine of 0. Zero. We're working in radians, remember, here. e to the power 0, anything to the power 0 is 1. The cosine of 0 radians is going to be 1 as well. The sine of 0 radians is 0. So this term disappears, so we're just left with 3 times 1, which is 3. So we've got the gradient of a tangent here, then, would be 3. So we now know that therefore, if that's the gradient of the tangent, by the perpendicular rule that the product of the gradient should equal negative 1, then the gradient of the normal, let's just write it in here, the normal at O, okay, is going to be minus a third. We just reciprocate this and switch the sign, so it's minus a third. And on that basis, we can find the equation of the normal. I'm just going to write an intro just so that we don't give the answer only. So we've got, therefore, the equation of the normal. What's it going to be? Well, it's going to be y equals mx plus c. It's going to have that format. We know it passes through the origin, so the c value is going to be 0. So the gradient is going to be minus a third, so it's y equals mx minus a third x. All right, so uh, you could leave it like that. It does say find an equation of the normal. It's not asking for any particular format. Might want to get rid of the 3 though, multiply both sides by 3, give you 3y equals minus x, add x to both sides, and you get equals 0. Up to you though, whichever form you might want to give it in. Anyway, there you go, that's how we find the equation of that normal.